CIBC First Caribbean has officially opened a new financial center at Rendezvous Christ Church with an emphasis on mortgages and loan financing. Managing Director of the bank, Mark St. Hill, says the center is the first of its kind in the region and will operate on 6,600 square feet of space. He says the rehabilitation of what was the old commercial bank at that location cost an estimated 1.5 million U.S. dollars noting that it will significantly enhance the bank's operations. Over the last 18 months, we have been reconfiguring our branch channels. And a big driver for this is to improve, our, is to improve the access points for our clients in making what I would say is their most important financial decision. Um, for a retail client, um, usually a mortgage, followed by a car and then health or education or, or whatever um, is a substantial investment for that client. What we have done in increasing those access points and what we would have seen over the, the last 18 months is a concept called the Loan and Mortgage Center. This goes a step further to becoming a true sales and finance center. Mr. St. Hill says this type of approach has helped the bank both in terms of customer service and overall performance. The end result of all of this, um, we are seeing our sales growing extremely well. Last year was a record year for us. Um, and, and, and what it means is that clients need somewhere to have a discussion with a financial advisor um, in, seeing, in, seeing, in seeing them through this process. Um, what has also done, our response times have increased, have improved tremendously. So our clients are more satisfied. The new financial center officially opened from today. Telecommunications company Digicel is staking a claim as having the fastest mobile network in the island. Digicel is citing an independent report by U.S.-based Brightcoms, an independent engineering services company specializing in providing total solutions to meet the dynamic needs of the telecom industry. In a statement, Digicel touted the speed of its 4G mobile network, noting that its 2G or voice network was also singled out for praise in the area of call quality. Digicel said Brightcom's benchmarking measurement allowed them to determine their network's performance in the market compared with competitors through an independent and reliable third-party analysis. The audit was carried out in Barbados by Brightcom's between January 5th and 12th this year. Here is a look now at how the stocks traded locally and regionally today.